Hey, we're back. So, uh, here's our shrimp. I set for maybe 10 15 minutes. And here's our oil on high, okay? And I've added it on high for like two or three minutes. And, oh man, there's a lot of glare. Here, I'll turn this off. So there's going to see the movement of the oil in the pan. Right now, that's telling me it's about 275. And I want it at 350. So I, these are just particles left over from other frying. The camera might die here. My batteries are dying. All right. Well, so. And then you'll see the oil kind of start moving in these little bubbles. And um, it's about 325 right now. now. I want to cook these at... It's like 300. Give them another second. I want to cook these at like 325, 350. Give them a second to brown. But I'm going to load the pan when I put them in. So yeah, now time, time to go. And the same factor with um, fried chicken and other heavy things. We've made this shrimp. <clears throat> Anyways, a little fire in the kitchen. Um, we made this shrimp. I can see that down there. <laughs> oh. Okay. And we're back in business. All right. So, um, so that means we got flippy shrimp. <laughs> I remember last year when I caught, well, anyways, yeah. Catching the set on fire is fun. Doing it with brandy and get pan hot enough on a good saute on a good gas burner. You can get it flame with just wine. But flaming with brandies and other stuff like that, man. It's intense flavor that comes through. Alright. Alright, so I flipped them. Looking at the other side. The other side's done. They're done. Okay. I'm gonna give him another second. I'm gonna turn it off. Now. I don't know. For some reason they look a little big. Then. So just another 20 seconds in the grease. Grease still hot. If you do that, if you wait too long when you pull something out to check it and kind of look at it and then throw it back in, you can really wait too long to throw it back in the grease and get a good fry on it. And you see it's getting a little darker than those. All right. And I've got the fryer off now. So I feel I should put those in too. See, see how they react though? Took a second of mixing them with all that hot heat for them to start frying hard, harder. But being it's just two shrimp, you can do it. 